All right, all right, all right. I went to Ulta. Um, before I get to the Ulta haul, I also went to Old Navy. And they had the cutest little furry Sherpa slippered socks. Look at them. Won't he do it? Yes, he will. They were $4. They were so cute. I had to get them. All right, so I went to Ulta and I grabbed a couple of things. I needed about... 60 no 58 or 59 before i went platinum i think it was so i had a list of things i wanted to get and i still forgot two things that i'm gonna go back and get them though so i got the morphe beauty blender sponge i have never tried it by morphe um i love real techniques and i love their beauty blenders but i wanted to try the morphe one so i picked that up I definitely could not leave without the it brushes by Ulta make it a night of it brushes you guys I don't know if you can see that but these are blinged out brushes and you know that's the only reason I got them these are blinged out brushes they regularly were a hundred and something dollars then down to 96 then 48 on the day that I went they were 30% off of the 48 and then I also had um, Ulta coupons I had Ulta coupons, so this was absolutely beautiful. I was hesitant about spending the money, but like I said, I needed to get to $59 so I could be platinum. So, um, put that where y'all can see it. Okay. Needed to get to 50, $59. So, those are the brushes. I grabbed the Morphe free bird lip gloss you guys i try to get away from the nudes but it doesn't happen it's not my fault nobody has beautiful pinks for me here's morphe free bird and i don't know if this is going to go up before or after christmas but you may see my christmas nails morphe free bird i saw this on instagram and i had to have it this is going to be one of those ones that just stays in my bag it's, it's just going to be one of those ones that just stays in my bag. It's absolutely, absolutely gorgeous. And that is Morphe's Free Bird. They had another one that I wanted, but they were sold out. Because I had two lip glosses on my list. Um, The next thing that I received, I was going to get the Ulta, not Ulta, Urban Decay Cherry. It was on my list. That's what I was going to get, the Urban Decay Cherry. And then my friend Ternika... And through my research, hit me to the Morphe 35F Fall into Frost Palette. So the Morphe 35F Fall into Frost Palette, if you do not know, is a very, very, very close dupe for the Urban Decay Cherry Palette. It has the cherries that you want. I didn't want blues and greens and all that stuff because I never wear them. I didn't want to waste money on another palette. Here is the Fall Into Frost palette. So with this palette, I still get my glitter, shimmery shades. I still get my matte shades. And I get all of my cherry, pretty much my cherry colors. Now, this is not to say that I won't go back and get the cherry palette. I'm going to swatch some for you. But the reason why, I'm swatching this color here. The reason why I chose this palette, that's that color. The reason why I chose this palette is because, number one, like I said, it was a lot cheaper than the Urban Decay one. Okay, I just swatched this one. There we are. It was a lot cheaper than the Urban Decay one, number one. And I wanted that brush set. That brush set was not on my list. <laughs> so sometimes you got a ball on a budget. You know, you got to sacrifice to get everything you want. Let me show you all this. And I got to focus this in. Hold on. Hold on. This is that gold I just watched. Do you see that? Do you see that? Look at that. Look at that. Look at her absolutely awesome so that was one of the reasons that i got the morphe um palette so this is the morphe palette and once again this is the morphe 35f 
And if you want the Urban Decay Cherry and you just cannot afford it right now, then this is something that you may want to go ahead and check out for your budget and then get the other palette at a later date. Like I said, this is not to say that I won't get the, um, the Urban Decay Cherry palette, but I just didn't get it at this time. With everything I wanted to get, I had to really, really um, budget myself. And the other thing that I wanted to get that I did not get was the um, new LA Colors foundation i have a video if i haven't uploaded it yet showing you guys um i'm waiting for ulta to do those buy one get one half off because i want two of those i already have one i want two more that's the other thing that was on my list that i did not get that i want to get but this is everything that i got from ulta um just to throw it in there my sister gave me this makeup revolution palette if i can open it before the video cuts off only problem with this Makeup Revolution palette is I can't never get it open. I always have to use something to get it open. This is the Makeup Revolution palette that my sister gave me. She knows I like like the golds and bronzes and, and I probably won't use the blues, but then again, maybe I will. But she was barely using it and so she gave it to me. And this is the Urban Decay Revolution and it looks like this. Fortune favors the brave. So yeah, it looks like that. So she gave me that when we got back. I went shopping at Ulta with my sister. And when we got back, she gave it, gave me that one. But this is everything that I picked up from Ulta, you guys. Um, I did really good. I am now platinum. I did not go over. I don't think I went over my $60 budget. This was $25 with 30% off. I think this was around $20 or $30. $8. Eight, six or $8. And then I had a 5 off $15 coupon, and then I had some Ulta Bucks. Your girl did good, and your girl is now platinum for Ulta. Hooray, won't he do it? All right, let me know what you guys picked up or picked up or have used. If you know anything about the Morphe lip glosses, this is my first time trying it. Um, let me know what you think about it. But I think the color is absolutely beautiful, and I'll see you guys in the next video.